You know, yesterday was a, a good day for us. I, I can't complain. It was an unbelievable fishing day. We caught, I'm guessing, around 35 fish, very similar to the first day. It was one of these deals, though, that I just didn't seem to be able to get bit by the big fish. Uh, we got a couple really good ones. Um, only lost one decent fish. Caught just little one after little one after little one. And, and you know, that's the way it goes sometimes. Where I know Chase was in the same area as I was. He's pulling the same baits, and he had a ton of big fish. So, you know, today's a new day. Uh, I might switch around. It might switch around just like it was the first day, where I get a lot of big fish bites. Um, or this north wind could change things. The cold front. We've got a cold front where it's almost 20 degrees colder than what it was. That may shut the fish down. You don't know. And your job is to go out there and try to do the best you can. So, you know, a good friend of mine, Ron Seeloff, one of the best walleye fishermen that I know, always said, hey, I'm just going fishing today. And that's really all that I plan on doing. Uh, excited to go into the last day. We've got two guys ahead of me that are tougher than nails. John Schneider is, is always just tough here on this, this body water. And this Ryan Dempsey kid, he probably knows the bay better than anyone in the whole area. The kid's phenomenal. So uh, gonna have work cut out for us, that's for sure. Uh, but, you know, if those fish are there and I get the right bites, we could have another 50, 50 55, 60 pound bag. I lost two sleds the first day or it would've been over 60. So I'm just hoping for that to happen again.